Hello and welcome to this video on time and work. Time and work is a very important chapter from quantitative aptitude perspective and a lot of questions are asked from this chapter. So let us look at uh, basically this video will help you to solve any question from this chapter of time and work. There is just one small little fundamental that you need to know and that will go a long way in solving any given question from this chapter. So let's start now let us let us look at the first question so a completes the task in three days b completes the same task in two days in how many days would the task get completed if both work simultaneously on it the simple thing to do here is calculate how much they can do in a single day so a completes the task in three days if a completes the task in three days it means it requires one by three it completes one by three of the task in one day in one day it completes one third of the task similarly b completes the same task in two days so in one day b completes half of the task one by two so a completes one by three b completes one by two of a task so in one day a and b together will complete one by three plus one by two which is five by six so they complete five sixth of a task in a day so how many days will it take the reciprocal six by five so i hope you understood the technique here calculate how much each of them will complete in one day add it up and then reciprocal that is a simple fundamental i am going to solve more three questions so that you get you, you understand what i'm talking about x completes the task in four days so it, in one day one by four y completes the task in 6 days so 1 by 6 in 1 day z completes the task in 2 days so 1 by 2 in 1 day how many days would it take for 3 to work together same like before just that instead of 2 there are 3 people add it up 1 by 4 plus 1 by 6 plus 1 by 2 and you will get 11 by 12 so how many days would it take if all 3 had to work together the reciprocal A and B can do a work together in four days. So together they complete one fourth in a day. Okay, together they complete one fourth in a day. Basically, when you read such a question or such a statement, immediately you should find out how much they do together or individually in one day. So they have given combined A and B. The, so and and four days, right? So they can complete one by fourth of the day uh, of the work in one day. If A can complete the work in 12 days, which means A can complete the work, the 1 twelfth of the work in one day, how many days would it be required to complete the task alone? So this is asked in a reverse manner, right? So we have to subtract here. How? So 1 by 4 is equal to 1 by 12 plus 1 by B. How much would B can do in one day? So 1 by 12 so 1 by 4 minus 1 by 12 is equal to b calculate you will get the answer as 6 i hope you are understanding the central idea here okay the central idea is to find out how much of the work is being done in one day that simplifies the whole sum for you so p works twice as fast as q so if q can complete a job in 12 days p can complete it in 6 days so q completes one twelfth of a job in a day p completes one sixth of a job in a day how many days will it take for them to complete together so 1 by 6 plus 1 by 12 okay 1 by 6 plus 1 by 12 will give you how much so it would take four days do the complete calculation yourself so that you understand what is really happening Apart from this, we also have 20 questions on this topic for you to practice on our website. So the link is in description or if you are watching this video on our website itself, you can go down and start solving the questions. Thank you.